Hello everyone, welcome to the next episode of my Animal Crossing New Leaf Let's Play. It's me, Nintendo LPRZ Dude, and I'm here, and I forgot to sell my items. Crap. <laughs> uh, well, it's 8.06. I guess I might as well be right back while I go store some, some things in my uh, storage. See you guys. Okay, I am back. <laughs> It's raining, so I grabbed an umbrella. Let's go to the RV campsite to see, uh, well, what special visitor we have in our campsite. Ooh, Wendell, I believe. If I'm not mistaken, this is Wendell's RV, so. I know we've seen him, like, I don't think we've seen him in this one. I think I had him in my, uh, personal town campsite, but not this one. So, yeah, here it is. Um, you know, if you visit a dream town, I haven't shown this off in any dream journals, but if you visit a dream town, he'll be there if the person allows for taking images freely, you know, as long as they have created it. Since I'm not an artist, I never really allow it, so he's never in my town in the dream, through the dream suite. So, there's that. You know, it's nice to see you could order some interesting furniture, some food items. I don't really find it interesting, so, you know... We're going to avoid that for now. I might return at some point else whenever he visits again in the future. You know, I never saw him in the rain. That actually looks adorable. <laughs> oh, God. Nintendo is just the king and doing something like that. And Does he really have that for stuff like this? Jesus. Or does that tent come with it? <laughs> I doubt the tent comes with it, but still. God. I... Did he just... Yeah, he turned. Wow. Interesting. Anyways, uh, let's go see one of the initiatives. Um, uh, fish it forward initiative. A fish thrives in its natural habitat. Luckily, it will also thrive when you donate it to the Roasted Museum. There's that. The mole cricket. Okay, yeah. I don't know what we're going to do. I mean, it's a rainy day, and a little fun fact about fishing in Animal Crossing. When it's raining, the fish are more abundant. So this initiative actually ironically came at a good time. Oh, I'm not even joking. It did. Oh, God. I mean, if I was to want to go fishing, literally, this would be the time to go. I mean, you know, not necessarily true. I mean, if it's raining after four, that'd be the time to go because you could actually catch... Uh, catch celia cans then well as long as it's raining or snowing but still <sighs> by the way for the next couple of episodes i will have the card on i will have a card in the top right hand corner of the video you can click on that eye icon and to visit the previous episode where you can vote for whom you want me to replace Celia with. Okay, I'm not going to be choosing directly. We finally have a new camper. Took a while. <laughs> Took till a rainy day. Who goes camping on a rainy day? It was sunny as heck yesterday. And now it's raining and I finally have a camper. God damn it. Uh, weird animals. Hey, you from around here? Oh, great. I've been looking for a local to chat with. I'm camp just camping here in Roston for a little while. But the town is really growing on me, despite my camping being ruined by the rain. <laughs> I know, I just faked that. But then again, if she was an actual person camping, that's probably one thing they would say. Probably would be like, should have checked the, the effing weather before I went camping. Mush wall lamp. I think I got like three of those now. I believe I may be mistaken, maybe two, but I know I've gotten that before. Uh, you know what, since I'm lacking on ideas right now, we uh, and it's not exactly noon, so you know I'll record a bit now and I'll do this on screen, and then you know I'll, the last thing we'll do is go to Club LOL, get our emote, and um, you know I'll cut ahead to that though. So I'll do the morning routine on screen, and I will, um, and after that, you know, if nothing else comes up, I may just cut ahead to the, uh, to 12 o'clock with, uh, and do Club LOL. 
Oh, there's that. It's a uh, fossil. Another fossil, so we got two of four. So there's that. Three of four. Let's do we're really nearby. I swear to God, if they aren't, th if they aren't from the same dinosaur, I'm gonna be asking questions. I'm gonna be like, okay, so they appear right next to each other. Since when do people dig up fossils right next to each other that aren't exactly from the same thing? You don't just dig up a Tyrannosaurus Rex skull and find a Triceratops body in the same spot, or do you? I mean, uh. Maybe if there was an earthquake and you're on a mountain or I, I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking too deeply into it. But I know there's got to be some sort of way to do that for that to happen in real life. But no, I, I'm probably just thinking too deeply into it. I'm nuts. And I'm probably certifiably insane as well. I don't know. But then again, who is? <laughs> who isn't? I could probably just go up to some random stranger, ask them a few questions, and have them certified to be mentally insane. To a point where they'd have to be held for questioning and supervision in a mental ward. Ah, then again, I'm not that mean, so I'm not going to. You want to question my sanity, do it. Just be warned, I may question yours. <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I'm trying to make banter. Oh, it's a pill bug. Yeah, I'm taking too long. Okay, we got back. Yeah, it took too long. Oh well. Trying to get that last. Trying to look for that last little fossil. Come out, come out, come out, wherever you are. I know you've gotta be here somewhere. Okay, I've heard looking for something making you go insane, but that just sounded like I was a lunatic looking for someone to kill. From like one of those 90s horror shows. I don't wanna kill you. I am serious. I don't wanna kill you. All I wanna be is your friend. That's not a pistol. <laughs> There we go, got them all that time. All right, let's see, how many slots do I have anyways? Two, f six, okay. So one, two, three, four, five, and six, all right. So now let's go to two and three, five, three, four, seven. All right, we got enough space to carry the other two. That should bring us to 16,100 bells. That's a good chunk of money. Money! Mama, money! <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I don't even listen to that song all that often for some reason. But then again, I don't think many people do. I think they just, you know, sing that one part. It's like that one part of that one, sh you know... That part of that song is like watching a TV show just for that one part of that show. You know, you don't give a sh crap about the rest of the show. All you care about is that one little part of that song. Everything else might as well just go screw itself. If you disagree with me, then I, 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 I think you've lost your humanity. No, I'm kidding. I don't know why I'm being so cruel. <laughs> It's the rain in this game. It's making me cruel. I'm gonna kill your parents, fishy. But first, I'm gonna catch you. Thank you. You're mine. What are you? You are a cherry salmon. Now for a cherry salmon pie. We can take care of the initiative now. I caught a new fish that I can donate. Lol. But I'm gonna donate it after I find the last fossil. Let's hope I can find it soon. And yes, they can be behind buildings, so you might want to spend some of your time looking. Oh, right, it's a balloon. Let's see here, there's my slingshot. I actually do want to try. Where is it? Here it is. 
There we go. I want to try to get the gold, the silver slingshot at the very least. And to be honest, unlike the other tools, I've actually had instances where I've actually gotten the gold slingshot before the silver one. So whatever comes first, comes first. I'm not going to really complain about getting like the gold before the silver. You know, it's... It's a little insane how that is. Nintendo should really fix that in like the next Animal Crossing game where it... it's a crick, it's a grasshopper or a locust or something. Oh well. Um, you know what? Might as well take out my net. I mean, it's raining. We might as well be doing something with the rain. There's nothing there. I'm pretty sure I had yet. Stop cheating your fucking, your, excuse me, I didn't mean to swear right there. Come on. No, come on. This thing hates me. Oh, come on now. No. Ah, yeah, finally. Rice grasshopper. Now I just need a soy sauce mantis. Ha <laughs> That one's so bad it's funny by me. This actually sounds like a joke my family would make. Jeez. Oh, no pill bug. Oh, there's the pop. There's the fake rock. <sighs> You guys have probably seen the falls. Thanks, but there it is. I was gonna say you guys probably saw the digs probably like a while ago and were probably yelling at me. Oh, it's by the cliff! It's by the cliff! <laughs> uh, I could already imagine that. Alright, so we got all the fossils. We got a fish. We got a new bug. Let's uh head to the museum right now after I put my tools away, of course. Always got to do that. And I will see you guys at the museum, all right? See you guys in a moment. I'm actually going to be taking out the rest of the fossils I have. The fossils I had him examine, I already had him donated. So um, I can switch those out with these two. See, are there any other fossils? I'm not sure if I donated a walking leaf before. Any other fossils I have in storage? Let's see. None there. Yeah, I don't think so. All right. So I've been examined those two fossils and um let's try to do a bomb rush of donating right now. Assess two more fossils, please. And to be honest, completing the fossil exhibit is actually the easiest one to do. Because you get four fossils a day, there's... Put on screen in the touchscreen area right now how many fossils there are in total. I'm not exactly certain yet. Okay, so... The rest of these, I'll store my storage for now, so yeah. Nothing. And I'll take out the rest of the bugs because I want to double check with him. So, you know, I'll see you guys if there is anything else for me to donate. If not, I'll see you back in town. Never mind, guys. I wanted to check if TNT Mart was open. I didn't think they were, but they are. Jeez, they opened up early in this game. Well, I guess not early, early because I believe other Animal Crossing games, the other ones open early as well. I'm just saying, like, he's the, like, they're the first door open. They're open before their father. Or, not father, their uncle. Jesus. Like, if, like, if my father owns a tile company, if I was to buy out that company from him and my father was to do some other job, 
I probably wouldn't open up earlier than my own father. I'd probably just take over the company to get some more sleep or something. But... Damn! They got some dedication. Although there was nothing there, so... Yeah, and the rest of the stores are closed, so... Let's head back into town and see what's going on. Alright, what is going on in town today? What time is it? It's 8.25 a.m., alright. What do I... What is there to do today? It's raining, so there's not much to do. Um... Visited our campsite. We have a camper there, which we saw. Visited the RV campsite, so... No, Wendell's there. Um... I guess this would be a good time for me to do a cut right now. I'll see you guys at... I guess noon? I guess noon would be a good time. So I guess the last thing we will do is, um... Oh, there's a bagworm. That's something I can use. Give me a moment. Learned a little something. You don't need to shake the tree to get it. There we go. I caught a bagworm. Ain't no one bagging on me now. I wonder what my new, what my encyclopedia says about my new catch. Let's go here. Yep, yeah, fish it forward. I got another bagworm. These two trees are just hopping in bagworms. What about this one? Nope. Now I just feel like going around trying to swing my net at trees. So I know I can catch a spider. So, um... You know what? Before I do that, let me pick these up so I at least have something. Because I'm actually going to give him the whole pile of three. Unlike donating fruit to villagers... You can actually give him a pile of three or more fruit. So a pile of, well, a pile of two or more. But, you know, you can give him an entire bunch of fruit if you want. And he'll accept it. Whereas, you try to do that to your villagers, they'll most, they'll just disregard it. And just, like, ah, oh, no, I can't eat this. You know, and your request, and the request will be canceled. So, yeah, it just ends up being, like, a... F.U. statement. You know, you you screw up, you're unable to help them. Ugh. Oh, nope. Oh, hold on. Bells. I'm Dutch, I need the bunny. Oh, nothing there. Oh. I should probably stop, but this is too fun. <laughs> Too much fun just whacking my net at trees. Up. Oh, okay. Nope. Negative. Because I know there's got to be, like, a spider in my tent somewhere, so... Yeah, no. Oh, what do you want, Celia? Yeah, sure, I have two of them. Straw shirt? Yeah, sure, let's do it. I don't mind. I got two. I was going to sell it anyways, but I got plenty of stuff in my storage that I'm going to have to sell, so... Oh, well, that's fine. Hmm. Feathers. It's an interesting catchphrase, but whatever. Let's see if I can catch something else. Yeah, nothing really there. Uh, leave that. I'm also believing that one of these trees has a beehive and I'd like to catch the bees. Yeah, and I hear the cat machine, I know. Let's take care of this. Plus one. Not really a lot, but it's there. Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. I'll see you guys whenever something comes up or at noon. Alright, hi everyone, I am back. <laughs> it's a bit later than I actually planned on it. I actually got a bit lazy. It's 5.25 p.m. But, you know, as long as it's after 12 and you and it's before 8, you can actually still learn an emotion. So don't worry if the sun's about to go down. You know, as long as it hasn't hit 8 p.m. yet, it's not that big of a deal. So let's go uh, get our emotion for the day and see what else we can do. So let's give him a pack of three cherries. All right, here we go, it's shrunk. I don't know what joke he's gonna teach us, but we'll see, shall we? All right, Dr. Frank is in the house. Laughter joke. All right, that's good. We could all use a good laugh. Have I ever got a serious case of the giggles today? Wanna know why? I got a standing ovation last night. But then I woke up and realized I'd just been dreaming. <laughs> Quick, short, to the point. Nice, Trunk. You seem to know my schedule. So, yeah, what do you think? I think this is the first time you've seen my laughter joke. Now you can add one more joke to your joke book. Use that joke book of yours to bur to bust out your laughter ability and develop your comedic skills. Thank you, Shrunk. And, yeah, in the back, I haven't shown it off yet, but you can change the gyroids. I will be doing that at some point later on. Um, while we're here, let's go down the row this way to the right. You know, not visiting the post office, of course, but starting with Nook's Homes, we'll go... Alright, check that TNT Mart, so uh, we'll check out Able Sisters and not... Um, Shampoodles, there we go, I couldn't remember the name for some freaking reason. Jesus. <laughs> uh, let's see Lyle, you know, it's been a while since we got our score. Alright, yeah, 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 shut the heck up. There we go, um, 6,169 points, and, um, now, let's talk specifics. Specific comments from my crew about your home first. Your cart, wow, well placed. Placement is big, big deal, very important. Red to the east, they say that to, they say that improves your item luck, so put red stuff to the east. My crew, they love that kind of stuff. They love to your placement into luck. Luck is good, bang. Let's see. That's about it. Almost. Little advice for the future. Here we go. Bang! So, Miss Natsumi, let's talk sets. Some items go together in sets. Could be two items, could be more. Set items? Usually sold separately. But they want to be together. Long to be. Meant to be. So get to it. When you complete a set, the satisfaction is worth the work. Most set items? Reasonably priced. Give collecting a try. Old Lyle wouldn't steer y'all wrong. By the way, 20,000 to 30,000 points is considered ideal for a house like yours, Miss Natsumi. Combinations? Limitless. Not unheard of to get more points than that. So don't quit now. So, enough food for thought. Pause to consider. Take it all in. Ponder some ponderance. It's all a journey. You, me, us, will make your home sing. Am I right? Of course I'm right, Miss Natsumi. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's, um... Yeah, thank you, Nook. Uh, let's visit Able Sisters now, see what they have in stock, and then, um, I think that'll just about wrap it up here for this episode. Again, I apologize for, uh, the earliness, the lateness of yesterday's and the earliness of today's episode. I'm counting them both as one. Oh, there's Kiki. She's in a Able Sisters. Nice. Let's see what she's up to. Oh, hi, Natsumi. What a coincidence meeting you here, kitty cat. So, how can I help you? I want to chat. I like learning about where different clothing styles come from. It's the best way to blend in on vacation. <laughs> best way to make pretend that you're also a spy. La la zing. Or not. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, red polka skirt. I'm actually going to buy this. I'm not going to try it on, but I'm going to buy it. Actually, I had something good in stock today. Uh, Sable? I believe, right? Mabel? Yeah, Mabel. I can never tell. I can never remember who's who. I just gotta remember, M for marketing and S for sewing. That's how I could remember it, okay? So, Mabel is marketing, so she sells. And Sable is sewing on the sewing machine, so she... They had this in the previous episode, didn't they? I think something's just calling me to that. 
And by that, I mean the cat, the cat hat. Now I really meant the Mario cap, but I'm not gonna buy the Mario cap. I'm gonna buy the cat hat because I like cats more. Oh, nice beak. I can use a beak. I need to blend in with the locals. They're planning a luau, and I'm probably gonna be the big. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, can you imagine that though? That'd be some creepy sort of mini game. That's what they should have put into Amiibo Festival and whatnot. Instead of a desert island escape, it's run away from your villagers before they roast you alive for being a for being different than. Them. <laughs> I mean, you know, animals eat each other. It's an animal animal world, I guess. I mean, you can't say dog eat dog world because that just sounds. That's. Would that be cannibalism? I mean, you know, I've seen the meme that it's uh, not easy being a vegetarian in the world of Pokemon. But god damn it, it must be hard being a meat eater in this in this society. Jesus. You eat a hamburger, you might as well be eating your cow neighbor. Oh, 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 oh. oh. and bacon, forget about it. You're eating your pig neighbor. <laughs> Oh god, I mean, unless it's fish, but then again, you eat an octopus again. Forget about it, you're eating your neighbor! <laughs> so I guess calamari is off the uh, table. Um, what else is there? Jesus, it's just. I think I depressed myself some somewhat because of this. God damn it. <laughs> oh, how about we go cheer myself up with a cup of coffee? Because, you know, um, that just. That just depresses me. It really does. Like, it, it that just makes me think. Clothing. I mean, I know that people in America and whatnot like to think that Gap has sweatshops. <sighs> but let's talk about sweatshops here. This dress. How, how many sheep villagers do you think it took to make it? And I don't just mean working for a fair price. I mean being shaven. You gotta think about that. It, it, it just doesn't sound pretty. I mean, this just turned a, took a turn for the worst, didn't it? <laughs> I'm talking about eating your villagers and trying to figure out how one could eat meat in this game. No wonder why every Thanksgiving Franklin runs away. Jesus Christ, that's terrifying. Remind me never to. Remind me to send my apologies to Franklin. This Thanksgiving, I gotta just say to him, I'm sorry, dude. You know, I, I'm a vegetarian. Well, lacto ovo vegetarian. Lacto ovo vegetarian. Meaning I eat milk. I eat milk products and cheese and um, bleh, egg products as well, so. But still. <sighs> I'm sorry about that. That's just. I think I creeped myself out with that one. The tree's growing nicely, though. Can't sit in front of it yet, so, you know. There is a certain point to which you need to grow your tree before you can actually uh, start over with the update. So, yeah. Why don't you to win trophy a bit? Um, I had something I want to give to Maple, but I'm so hungry I can't move very far. Do you think you could make a delivery to Maple for me, Natsumi? Please. I'm on it. Great! Here's what I want you to deliver! <laughs> I gotta stop doing voices. I mean, do you guys like it when I do voices, or do you guys just hate it? I don't know. So we gotta find Maple. <coughs> Excuse me. Come on, let's try to... Find that much again. She lives yeah, right there. Okay, she's probably at home right now. Like, indoors. I believe I saw her. Yeah, the lights on her place. She's at home. So I might as well visit her right now, eh? And I apologize. This video has probably become somewhat extendedly long. But, you know, this is the last thing I'll do. Oh, well, I didn't mean to say hi. Uh, delivery time. Let's see what, he, see what anchovy got her. I mean, if she tells me of it. Alright. And it's furniture. Wow, it's a billiard table. Nice. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, furniture again. 
What did she give us? Blue cabinet. Nice. You know, she really does have a good house. But then again, I have no sense of interior design, so screw it. She pro her house probably does stink. I mean, it, I can't even see a pattern, but then again. Walking stick. Sneak away so we let it sleep or whatever. So, yeah. Let's end this off on the beach. Might as well, you know. No better way to end a video, eh? You know, while we're here, let me tell you a little something. When I was creating this town, I did have high thoughts of building a house here and having a little beachfront property in a way. But then I was thinking, you know what? Nah. I like being closer to the river and whatnot and having easier access to the train station. So, you know. So I just don't that far of a walk to the beach anyways. Let's go on the dock. I'm not going to visit the island, but, you know. Nothing quite look quite like looking out at the ocean, eh? Pokemon Sun and Moon are on the horizon. I'm looking forward to that. Just wanted to take the time to advertise a series within a series, so, um... Yeah. Pokemon... My Pokemon Sun Let's Play is starting up in about a... About a couple weeks. November 30th. I want to be somewhat courteous to my British viewers. Yep, you guys may not feel it, but I do think about you guys a lot. By the way, I know I said this in my 500 subscribers Q&A announcement video, but really do appreciate it. Keep viewing. Stay strong. And with that, that ends this day. I guess almost literally. The day is nearly over. Sun setting. <sighs> Very calming day. You know, I'll end this by walking to my house in silence. Just enjoy the music. <laughs>